Or the violin had bad scratches and cracks and color disformities and missing pieces and the back was cracked in half. So when we were at the antique store, there's three violins in the glass case. And there was only two of them that you could see. So I asked him, is there a third violin in there? And he said, uh, I don't know. And then we opened it up. And in the wooden case, I should say, we found this Hoff violin. And the guy who got out with us looked at it and he was like, whoa, that thing needs a lot of work. So then... My father was like, well, that's the one she wants. She wants the one with all the work that he's done to it. And, and yeah. So even when I pulled that one out of the case, the dude was like, wow, you're not going to be able to fix that. And I'm like, yeah. It'll look beautiful when I'm done. I have the Hoff violin finished. It's a completely different violin. And the guy at the antique mall would be like, that's not the same violin. There's no way. But I really enjoyed fixing up this violin. It was actually among one of the harder violins that I've done. But it was a lot of fun. And hopefully in the future I'll be able to make more videos for you guys like this one. Or like the Hoff fixing ones. Yeah!